The Barto Farto humiliation is fucking on point. Just knocking out everybody with shovels. But it's not even like the way that we dismiss them in the combat. Because after we defeat them physically, we then torture them mentally. He just goes there and starts teabagging them, taunts them. It psychologically destroys them. It is so disrespectful. I absolutely love it. We got one more prince to take down. This dude seemingly has the greatest technology from this kingdom. But who gives a fuck when we have like Luxion, which I think is like the best ancient tech let's begin today's reaction <laughs> oh my god oh shut the fuck up bitches <laughs> yeah it's been 4-0 we just slapped them with a shovel so only his armor is good oh a pretty hype soundtrack is actually playing for this battle. Yo, our friends are gonna become so rich when we win this. Dude, this thick boy is so nimble. Oh, cool flame effects. Yeah, artistic effect, right? Value? Look, it's all flashy. Ooh, manipulating them more. I want them to fight over her, man. Oh, we probably know a lot more than them. <laughs> Angie! No! Angie deserves better, dude. No. The prince does not deserve Angie. This bitch, they can all die, though. Gracefully step aside. Yeah, what about Angie? She does! You treat her like shit! Hmm. Wait, what? The real me. You think the Marie sees the real you? Huh. Yep, straight up getting manipulated and tricked. Yep. You have the best technology from this fucking kingdom. Who are you to say about this? Like, are you fucking kidding? What is this hypocrisy? Bro, we beat them with a shovel! A fucking shovel! Yes, I'm enjoying myself! Oh yeah! I love looking down on these fucking pompous assholes. Lecture? No, we are fucking teabagging them like this is some fucking cod lobby. Shut the fuck out of my face! He loves it. He loves it. Uh huh. Mmm. Mmm. Yes! Arrogant Arrogance, the robot name. <laughs> what the shovel? Country Bumpkin with the shovel? True. Fuck Zora, dude. This bitch. <laughs> right, those three girls. Are, who the fuck are they? What is the Rattata doing here? True. True. They don't know our pain. <laughs> the other mob characters are now able to relate. <laughs> you could never understand. Until one of us is dead? We've said that we were willing to kill the prince. Now, I don't know if we're actually going to kill the prince, but if the prince dies in this episode... Wow. Wow. And she's still crying because the prince keeps fucking saying it's all about Marie. Yo, and she just needs to realize that she deserves better than the prince. If only she could realize that. Oh, man. <laughs> Fuck him. You don't need him. <laughs> Angie, come on, girl. I know she's programmed to be infatuated with the prince. It's not that easy. <laughs> Olivia. Olivia. This girl that's been on the bench for about five episodes. Is about to do something now? Is this the true female lead of this show? What's she doing? Oh, okay, let her, let her cook. Okay. Sure. Sentimental soundtrack, playing defense for Angie. Dude, this really humanizes Angelica to everybody. She's just being the perfect wing woman. Oh. 
<laughs> She's just loud. <laughs> Wait. Wait, huh? It's a mysterious power. So we're not just memeing that she's just yelling that. She's somehow able to reach everyone's hearts and minds. Now she just loud? No, 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 no. The wording here is very... Yeah, this is some main character power. So we know that Olivia is supposed to be the main girl of this show. But then Marie somehow got in the game and Mar Olivia will step aside. But I guess technically because Olivia is like a named character in this game, she has this ability. <laughs> Who's kind of strong? Cause she's trying to fucking erase Olivia, right? Yeah, she actually cares about you. No, no, she manipulates you though. Look at that smile! How do you know not? Cause he's a fucking, he's a fucking main character too. He's a fucking NPC. How ironic is this? How fucking ironic is this? Alright, no more speech time. Time to battle. Is someone actually gonna die though? Is someone actually gonna die though? Come on. Huh? Wait? Where's he going with this? Where is Leon going with this? A sacred duel that you guys have already cheated in. <laughs> so rude. So <laughs> rude. Where is he going with this? Continues to antagonize himself. <laughs> I, I, I want to believe that everyone's just saying this shit because they want their money, like, not lost. Because again, everyone fucking bet. The, the odds are, like, kind of cracked right now. If we win, we're going to all become, like, billionaires. <laughs> Huh. He's playing the villain for the sake of the prince? Huh. Well, he does enjoy the villain role, I think. Yeah. This is fun. Baruto Baruto? Oh, oh, oh? Hand to hand? The sword's gone? That was too easy. Angelica's son. Red Dog Day Buckle, taking him as ever. Tachiba, my Yurag. Politics at play. Okay. So by using his head, we'll be able to break them up? He doesn't care, right? He's willing to give it up all for Marie, right? Yeah, he's willing to walk away from it. But would Marie be fine with walking away? What are we about to do? What are we about to do? Impact. What? Okay, did you look at the smoke there? Did, did you look at the smoke there? Look, 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 look. Impacto! Impacto! <laughs> it doesn't look bad. I mean, it's not a big deal. I just thought I'm like, what the fuck? Oh my god! Okay, so is, is, is he done? I mean, the analysis said that he wouldn't die, right? But like, is, is, is he just done now? Baruto Barto wins! Baruto Baruto! <laughs> now our friends are gonna be so rich! Don't gamble, kids! 1v5. What was that impact, though? Angie, you, you, you wanna marry? Okay. Okay. Fuck it, we'll just continue being the villain. Leaving the academy? Huh? Man, she's at his fucking bedside!
Dude, this fucking prince, dude. Oh my god, like, this hurts me so much. How much Angie just fucking goes back to him. He's just so fucking mean. He doesn't even know he's being gaslit and manipulated. It's- this is insane. She deserves so much better than the prince. What? It's Marie soup. Shut! I thought we're doing soup! Alright, favorite food, whatever. Fuck you. Did she notice because she fucking played the game? You dumbass! Ah! At least he knows he's being rude. I want the prince to actually fucking throw away his title thing. You know what, Marie? All I need is love and you. Throw away his title. I will no longer be the prince. And Marie's like, <laughs> Alright, bye, bitch. Bye-bye. Next one. Mm -mm. Girl, you just gotta move on! Girl, you just gotta move on! Don't bow, don't bow, just walk out, that's right, fuck him. Don't even pray, curse him. Fucking curse him. God, he sucks, dude. Wait, just because he said this suddenly, redemption is back on the line. He's not completely gone just yet. I don't know, that line kind of makes it feel like... Mm. Yeah, she's already said plenty of shit like that, but whatever. <laughs> what is this? Head of the Red Gray family. Red Gray family is Angelica's fr family, right? Forfeit as knights. Decline the barony. But money? Money? Money. I don't know. Just to hurt the egos of the husbandos, right? I'm a hero. Do you think they would offer Angie to us? Probably not, right? <laughs> Hmm. Wait! Therefore? Give us the- give us Angie! Hmm. Wait, 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 isn't this the fucking cursed timeline where she gets sent off to the fucking countryside bumpkin, right? Is, is, didn't we talk about this, like, past? Wait, wait, wait! Yo, the master's goaded. I love the master. He actually clapped. Daniel Raymond's fucking financially set for their lives now, right? It was pretty fun. It was actually fun. Just shitting on them, though. Yeah. It's not about the money. It's about sending a message. They acknowledge him. But inwardly. Hmm. Oh, wait. <laughs> Olivia just got. Is Olivia just like Angelica's, like, I don't know, side girl now? Okay. She didn't, yeah. At least Angie has Olivia to hang around with. Yeah, you should thank Leon. See, she's self-aware. She's self-aware. And look, Sion, listening. Leon, listening. This, this, he just accepts it, though. You're just a piece of shit, aren't you? Yeah, I am. Okay, we're back in the countryside. Okay, back at Lady Zora place. Yo, that's a dub. We're bringing two girls, actually. Ugh. Oh my god, her kids even fucking grew up too. Ew. 
Annoying. Annoying. Oh, he is here. Shee! Wait, wait, what the fuck is Leon's face? Did you see Leon's face? <laughs> <laughs> he looks so sinister, dude. He looks like he's fucking ready. Damn, Angie's here, though. Angie, I mean, wouldn't this Lady Zora be like, damn, Angelica Redgrave? That's amazing. Would she actually give us credit? Redgrave. Red the Grave. Massacre. Yeah, look at Leon's eyes. Leon knows, it's like, yeah, she, you can't get compared to a fucking red grape. Get the fuck out of here, Bart Fart. That's right, you better give him some respect. Zora can't talk back to her. Oh, this is great. Get out of here. Finally, finally, she gets put in her fucking place. Thank God, dub Angie. Let's go, Angie! Let's go! What are these floating islands, though? How do they just float? Oh, yeah, and we have an actual island, too, right? Forgot about that. What? Hot spring episode? Ooh. Here we go. The yep, the nipples are gonna be carefully covered with their hair. And the the smoke, the sorry, the uh what's the word? Huh? Oh that's big. What what? Is is the prince just a fucking lollicon? <laughs> no, right no, right? <laughs> No, the, what they're... Olivia's just... I don't even know what Olivia is anymore. He doesn't, right? I don't think he does. I mean, if she says she's an awful woman and Leon's always saying he's like an awful man, I think this is a match made in heaven. Or hell. Hmm. Well, what the fuck is happening here? So Olivia has pretty much just become like Angelica's best friend. I, I it's just a year, little bit of Yuri. Uh, uh, are, are we, do, are we actually going with the Yuri route? Olivia, Angie, not, none of them matter. Leon's just here to be just a fucking dick to the princes because they deserve it. And they get a fucking Yuri ship and every, everybody's happy. Yo, it, I mean, that's an incredibly based outcome. <laughs> What, what the fuck? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. What? I, I, I don't know. I, I feel like close friends don't just look at each other like this. <laughs> I'm all for it. I am all for it. Let's go, Angie and uh, Olivia. Olivia. <laughs> all right, it's Olivia now. Angie Livia. Yes, revenge. Let me help you with it. Yeah. Yeah, revenge plot. I think so. Why not? Come on, let's start some drama. I don't know how- Okay, Angie was fucking ready for the revenge. Look at this. Holy shit, she was so ready. But, like, the best way I think that we can get revenge is, like, again, just, like, making the prince drop his title. He gets banished as a fucking commoner, but then Marie just, like, fuck you, peasant. That would be funny. I don't know. This is a very wholesome revenge. This is true. The best way after like a breakup is to just like thrive. If you're just like <laughs> posting pictures of you just being like happy with like other girls or just you're just doing better, right? Then your ex is like, this motherfucker's living his fucking best life. How this shouldn't be possible, you know? That okay, okay, we're thinking, we're thinking. Yeah, just ignore them and just live your best life and they mold at you. Okay. This is actually very based revenge. Okay, friends don't just hold 
Okay, no, 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 no. <laughs> Everything in this episode was already pretty sus in the Yuri stuff, but like, when, when you all hands <laughs> like this. Come on. Come on now. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the way they're looking at each other. Okay, the Yuri ship is officially done. Okay, it's, 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 it's Yuri. Right. Marie. They're all... All the princes are... Wait? So... It's not... I, it's not just... It's not just the main prince just dropping his title and saying all I need is the... All the princes dropped? Suddenly she can't cloud chase anymore? Wait? Wait? <laughs> Oh, what? <laughs> she doesn't give a fuck about that, right? <laughs> this is perfect! This is perfect torture because she never gave a fuck about them! She just cared about their status! And now what's she gonna do? Is she gonna be like, mask off? What is she gonna do? <laughs> Green hair dude is still so fucked up, dude! <laughs> Well, we're all peasants now, Marie. Come on, let's live in happiness. Get fucked. They're all stupid. Okay. Can't be with there on the side. They're still trying to get the revenge. Huh. Will they actually get lost items? Wait, they don't have money? I thought they were rich as fuck. See, that's all she cared about. Just the money, the clout, the fame, the luxurious life that comes with dating these bandos. Evil girl. Get the fuck out of my face. Tears of joy, yeah, that's tears of joy. Shouldn't we get promoted? Come on! Okay, the red gray is pretty much handled the fallout. Title? What is it? The prince's foolish behavior. Yo, are we about to get a crazy promotion? What? what? Upper 6th rank? I don't know what that really means. Upper 6th rank? Like, I don't really know, like, the tiers list, but all, all right. All right. Is that the episode? Or do we have a little bit? We have a little bit more. So a knight at 16 is fucking insane. Like, no one has ever done this before. Okay. <laughs> The dude that we fucked up, his parents are promoting us. <laughs> oh my, oh my, oh. Yo, is, is that Julius' mom? Is that mother? Yo, maybe we got a different girl to target, guys. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, why is she blushing? <laughs> we shit on your son. We shit on your son and you're fucking blushing and you're about to promote us? Beside your fucking husband, you're fucking giving us that eye? Oh, oh, we got a, we, okay, we got a new girl to go for, guys. Cool, cool. CGI fountain. Yo, they're still talking shit to us, though. Oh. Damn, if you just grabs us? This is an overall dub, guys! I mean, we got two girls instead of one. This is great! God damn. That was a pretty good fucking episode. Dunking on the prince, bro. Fucking... What was this? Impact? So we have different armors, but the skill that Luxion used here was pretty crazy. We still have only shovel used, but goddamn, we got a lot more weapons. Marie... Sorry, Olivia and Angie. 
they are straight up just the ship. Like, what? Okay, I'm down for it. Is it gonna be a threesome? Probably not. I love how Lady Zara couldn't talk back anymore because this bitch has been so annoying. But Red Grey family, higher status. You can't talk shit, right? This is great developments. Now, Marie is just pretty much suffering and the princes just dropped their titles like, oh, it's just for love, right? So you don't care, right? That's like, Marie cares a lot. I just want there to be a moment where Marie just has a mask off and the princes are like, ew, it's that kind of moment. But maybe that'll be in the future. I don't really know. I'm just trying to think of the most poetic endings, like justice, some kind of revenge for this bitch. But we'll see what it, what happens. And I hope this like a uh, demi-human slave, he just continues to shit on Marie. Because I love how this kid just continues to say the most like rude things right beside her. And then she's like, this kid's getting fucking annoying. But that's it for me. Hey guys, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.